Okay. I've attached the uh, manifold to the head. And I'd spare you the video on that because that involved a lot of cussing. And if anybody's ever done this before. Um, I'm a new at this. I'm, I don't do engines all day. I'm not a mechanic. Aside from being a shade tree mechanic. Um, and the extremely... The rear bolt under the starter and the front uh, bottom bolt gave me the hardest problem. Hard to get a socket on there because it was so close to the manifold itself so I had to adjust everything around and loosen all the bolts up and shift the manifold a little bit and it was on off and on off and just ridiculous all day. This this project took me about two weeks when it should have been taken should have just taken one day. So um that gives you an idea of the lack of skill set that I have. But anyway, um, this bear is uh, nearly come to a complete end. Yesterday I picked up the gasket that uh, fits between the pipe and the uh, manifold. Uh, I'm going to bolt this up and probably going to uh, run it down and put some lock washers on it afterwards. But I'm right now going to bolt it up and test fit it and make sure it seals all the leaks out or steals all the exhaust leaks out and so forth um in doing this job i put the starter back in i might have cross threaded one of the bolts in the transmission bell housing and i really at this point don't give a shit because that transmission's coming out at some point it's only a automatic two-speed or mercomatic or whatever two-speed and it is a piece of garbage so anyway this is the bottom side of the manifold and well in a minute i'll show you the top side of it there you go i don't know how clear that's coming up because i'm doing this on my phone and my vision isn't that good and all but anyway new manifold is in old manifold is out and just got to run some bolts down and that'll be good so anyway next video i'll do is uh probably going to be the engine running no promises or anything like that but probably going to be the engine running at least quieter without any uh tip tissing or hit hissing or anything like that so all right have a good day happy wrenching